Um, so I went to the Library of Congress for the first time when I was 11, and I fell in love with the archive very quickly. Um, I thought it was incredible how much there was, and um, uh, Steve and Jennifer were very helpful in, in helping me choose what to listen to, and I really never wanted to leave. I've been back several times, and I could just stay there for weeks and weeks. Um, so uh, when I was studying Helen Hartness Flanders, she did a lecture recital in February of 1948, and she had three singers, and um, Elmer George of Vermont sang King John and the Bishop. So that's what I'll be singing today. Um, and I have a picture of them all at the Library of Congress. So the one in the middle, seated in the middle, is Elmer George, and above him is Flanders. Um, and it was, uh, it, was a, um, it was a lecture recital of New England ballads, and all of them were chosen very carefully to show what Flanders wanted about New England ballads and the culture of New England. And this one I love in particular because it's a very jaunty riddle ballad. Let me tell you a story, a story of one who was a young prince whose name was King John. He was a man, a man of great mirth. He sold great rights and he downed all wrongs. Timmy down, down, Derry I down. One morning the king, to make himself merry, he sent for the Bishop of Canterbury. Says he, Mr. Bishop, they tell to me that you keep a far greater house than me. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. Now if you don't answer to my questions three, your head shall be taken from your body. And if you don't answer to them all right, your head shall be taken from your body quite. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. The first one I sit on my royal estate with my golden crown all on my old pate. And with my nobility, joy, and great mirth, you're to tell to one penny just what I am worth. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. The second one is, without any doubt, how long I'll be traveling this whole world about. And the third one is, that when I do wink, you're to tell to me presently just what I think. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. The bishop on returning home, he met an old shepherd and that all alone. Good morning, Mr. Bishop, the shepherd did say, what news have you brought us from court today? Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. Well, if I don't answer the king's questions three, my head shall be taken from my body. And if I don't answer to them all right, my head shall be taken from my body quite. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. The first one he sits on his royal estate with his golden crown all on his old pate. And with his nobility, joy, and great mirth, I'm to tell to one penny just what he is worth. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. The second one is, without any doubt, how long he'll be traveling this whole world about. And the third one is, that when he does wink, I'm to tell to him presently just what he thinks. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. Well, are you a man of learning and wit to answer those questions so soon put to it? But for one suit of your fine apparel, I'll go to King John and I'll answer the quarrel. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. Well, one suit of my apparel I'll give, and five pounds a year as long as I live. So the shepherd has gone, and that all alone, to answer the questions to Royal King John. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. Good morning, Mr. Bishop, the king replied, and have you come to live or to die? Well, I hope your grace will pardon me. I've come to answer to your questions three. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. Now the first one you sit on your royal estate with your golden crown all on your old pate. And with your nobility, joy, and great mirth, I'm to tell to one penny just what you are worth. Timmy down, down, Terry, I down. 
Well, for thirty pieces our savior was sold by a false witness so barbarous and bold. So about twenty-nine should be or just two, for I think he was one piece better than you. Timmy down, down, Terry I down. The second one is, without any doubt, how long you'll be traveling this whole world about. We'll start with the sun and keep up the pace, and in twenty-four hours you'll have finished the race. Timmy down, down, Terry I down. The third one is that when you do wink, come to tell to you presently just what you think. Well, that I can do, so make your grace merry. You think I'm the Bishop of Canterbury. Timmy down, down, Terry I down. But you are mistaken in that one alone. I am an old shepherd, the Bishop's to home. Well, that's all right, he says with a smile, for I'll make you bishop a little while. Timmy down, down, Terry I down. Oh, there's no use in talking, there's no need to fight, for I can neither read or write. But tell the old bishop, go tell him for me, that he'll get a frisky one if he gets me. Timmy down, down, Terry I down. Thank you.